Do you know that vitamin B12 plays a vital role to our body's overall health, but many people are deficient in it? From energy production to brain function to red blood cell production, vitamin B12 is essential. But what happens when our body is not getting enough of it? Hi, I'm Dr. Legrand, and I'm gonna talk about the 10 warning signs and symptoms when it comes to vitamin B12 deficiencies that you should not ignore. First, vitamin B12 is critical for the production of red blood cells, which are involved in helping giving oxygen and traveling oxygen throughout our body and giving it to our tissues. Now, when we are deficient in vitamin B12, guess what? That oxygen is not being carried sufficiently to our tissues, which of course the lack of oxygen is going to lead to weakness, fatigue, and exhaustion. Additionally, vitamin B12 is involved in the production of energy throughout our body. It helps convert food into energy that our body can use. So when there's a deficiency in vitamin B12, the body is gonna have a hard time converting that food into energy and therefore is gonna lead into to fatigue, weakness, and exhaustion. Vitamin B12 plays a critical role when it comes to protecting the nervous system, especially the sheath that wraps around the nervous system, which is known as myelin. So when there's a vitamin B12 deficiency, there could be damage to the myelin and therefore not protecting the nervous system, which then can lead to nerve problems, which these nerve problems can lead to numbness and tinglings in the hands and the feet. So if you're experiencing that, possible you have a vitamin B12 deficiency. Vitamin B12 is also really involved when it comes to the production of several different neurotransmitters that are vital when it comes to our memory, our cognition, and focus. So when there is a vitamin B12 deficiency, we can see problems with several different neurotransmitters that also can be deficient when we don't have a good adequate amount of vitamin B12, which then of course can lead to confusion, memory loss, as well as focus issues like ADHD. Because vitamin B12 is involved in the importance of building red blood cells, and we know that those red blood cells are important to carrying oxygen to a lot of the different tissues throughout our body body, when there is a deficiency in vitamin B12, not only is there issues of carrying that oxygen, what that can actually lead into is showing signs of pale skin, which can show a more washed out appearance in your skin color because there's not being enough oxygen and blood carried to those tissues. So this can be a sign, if you have pale skin, can be a sign of lack of vitamin B12. On top of that, pale skin can also be contributed to because of anemia, which is a lack of iron, but also can be deficiency of vitamin B12, which is another form of of different anemia. So you could be, have a possibility of low iron, but also vitamin B12 that could cause that anemia, which would also contribute showing pale skin. Now, because vitamin B12 is involved heavily with the different neurotransmitters and building those specific neurotransmitters, more specifically things such as like serotonin and dopamine, both of those are particularly for actually regulating our mood. And because vitamin B12 is so important for building those, when we see a deficiency in vitamin B12, we can see differences in our mood changes, especially anxiety, depression, and even ADHD. Vitamin B12 deficiency can also lead into psychosis, which is, of course, symptoms where an individual breaks reality, can have hallucinations, delusions, and, of course, disordered thinking. Now, if you're getting value in today's video, then go ahead and hit subscribe, hit the like button so you can find out more videos like this about how to optimize your brain. Another thing that vitamin B12 plays an important role is the production and the maturation of white blood cells, which plays a key role in the body's immune response and protecting the body. So, therefore, when there's a deficiency in vitamin B12, it can cause a decrease in the production of white blood cells, which then can lead into weakening the immune system. As before, I mentioned about vitamin B12 is so critical for producing red blood cells, and of course those red blood cells are helping with oxygen. Because of that, when we see a deficiency with vitamin B12, and because it can decrease our white blood cells as well as decrease the oxygen to our tissues, there can be symptoms such as short breath. So if you've been experiencing having short breath, there could be a possibility it might be vitamin B12, especially if you've talked to a lot of doctors and they can't explain it, it could be a vitamin B12 deficiency going on here. Because also vitamin B12 is important for the protection of the nervous system. When those different myelin sheaths are damaged, that can also contribute to certain types of nerves to our eyesight. And when that is damaged, that can cause issues with our vision, such as blurred vision, as well as double vision, and changes in color perception. Additionally, vitamin B12 is involved in preventing certain abnormal blood vessels in the eyes in a condition called age-related macular degeneration. It's definitely the leading cause of vision loss in older adults and can cause severe vision problems. Another really interesting thing about having a vitamin B12 deficiency because
because it's important of the two things that we mentioned before about it protecting the nervous system, protecting the sheath, the myelin sheath that protects that actual nerve. And if it's damaged because of due to lack of actual vitamin B12 deficiency, but on top of that, it's also important for moving oxygen. So this a symptom that some people will experience with vitamin B12 deficiency is a sore tongue as well as a redness of the tongue. So if you've experienced a sore tongue and redness of the tongue might be due because of a vitamin B12 deficiency. Another interesting thing, when you have a vitamin B12 deficiency, because going back to it protecting the nervous system, most certainly it can cause issues with your balance. So they have seen this where if you're having balance problems and you can't be, and it can't be explained by anything else that your doctor can't figure out, sometimes it could be a vitamin B12 deficiency because of how important vitamin B12 is for the nervous system. If you truly want to understand how vitamin B12 and just vitamin Bs can be so important for your health, then you should watch this video next where I took a complex vitamin B for 30 days. So watch this video now to find out my experience of how important it is for your health.